I have a uh, eight-year-old Duralas battery here that I'm gonna. It's getting a little weak. The cold crane key amps are getting a little low, so I'm gonna run some Epsom salt through it and see if we can get the cold cranking apps to go up just a little bit. See what, see what we got. It was manufactured C-3, or it actually says 3 dash 3 but if you don't know what the C code means, or generally there'll be a letter code, A, B, C, D, E, F, whatever, they correspond to A would be January, B, February, um, and the 3 at the end, the, uh, the other number is the year, so C means March of 2003 is when this battery was manufactured, so it's just under 8 years old, um, it still cranks the vehicle, works decent, but I can tell it's getting a little sluggish, so I'm going to run a, uh, let's run a cold cranking amp test on it and see where it's at. 4.38 volts. Ready? Click it. And I am showing, according to this thing, roughly just a little under 200 cold cranking amps. And I'm about 10.97 volts, 96 volts. At a 100 amp draw, kick it off, and it jumps right back up. We're over 12. It's climbing. It's climbing. So, right now the battery is 45 degrees or so. Forty-four point six. You're gonna to want to use distilled water. Pretty much just enough to dilute what you got and distribute it. I've got about four tablespoons in there. will solidify a little bit better if it's heated up. I ended up with about a half a cup and four tablespoons. So I'm just going to evenly divide it between all four or all six cells. Let's hook the charger back up to it. It's been about four days since I put the absence all in. Um, I discharged the battery a little bit by hooking a hooking a car light bulb to it. Uh, let it let it run for a couple hours. Recharged it with the battery charger. Discharged it a little bit for three hours or so again with the car light bulb, and then recharged it. And it's been off the charger now for um, about 36 hours, so it can even out just like it was last time. The first test I showed. It'd been off the charger for about 36 hours, so it already has just um, a lot higher, just stable voltage. The voltage right now is 12.2, 12.72 volts just sitting, which is um, really good. So 12.72. I got the load meter hooked up. Um, the battery temperature, because temperature makes a difference. It's actually a little bit colder. It's actually 43.5 degrees right now. I think it was 44 before. So degree degree colder. Sitting at 12.72 volts. Let's do a load test. Before it was just under 200. 400. Probably 300. 3, 375, somewhere in there. I'm still loading it. 375, 400, and the voltage is 11.28, and it's staying there. There we kicked it off. Jumps right back up over 12 volts and climbing. So, by putting in the Epsom salt, helped. It gained power almost instantly. Epsom salt works again. It gives the battery. More life, more cranking power. Um, opens up the pores or something in the lead plates. So.
There's another test.